Right now, a Palm Beach County Animal Rescue needs your help. Justin Bartlett Animal Rescue has two hospitals to help homeless animals. But the nonprofit is trying to open a shelter of its own. Taylor Hernandez has the story. I'm standing in the adoption center for the Justin Bartlett Animal Rescue. Right now, they are bursting at the seams here and in all of their foster homes. Crates stacked on top of crates. <laughs> lining the halls of what's supposed to be a calm place for nursing dogs to recover at the Justin Bartlett Animal Hospital. We're really bursting out what seems right now. We got more than what we can handle. Peter Torres has worked in animal rescue across Palm Beach County for two decades. He says the need here has never been greater. Right now, there probably there's four times as many rescues as we had when I first started doing rescue here and still not enough. What started as an entirely foster-based rescue back in 2012 now includes two low-cost animal hospitals in the county. But with demand increasing and foster homes full, the Justin Bartlett Animal Rescue needs a shelter of its own. We get at least one email from the uh, Palm Beach County shelter uh, daily. Uh, we rescue a lot of um, cases from Miami-Dade Animal Services. Torres says while funding is a big problem, so is zoning and pushback from people who don't want an animal shelter in their city. The hospital is okay. Anybody would open, you know, allow us to build a hospital anywhere. But when it comes to the actual shelter, it's been a challenge. The rescue secured a $2 million small business loan and has its eye on a piece of land in Loxahatchee Groves. But they need help before they can move any ground. We already raised $100,000. Now we need 200 more to go into the bank and say, here, now let's secure this loan. You can find links to help the Justin Bartlett Animal Rescue in this story on our website. Reporting in Royal Palm Beach, Taylor Hernandez, WPBF 25 News.